I have conducted Bach St. John Passion, St. Matthew Passion, and this is the first time that I'll be conducting a Bach B minor mass, and it's very exciting. And this is actually, I think, musically the most challenging um, masterpiece um, out of all the major works that Bach has written. So two years ago, um, when the Malaysia Bach Festival were performing the Bach St. John Passion, the Lutheran Bishop showed up at the concert and at the reception, we um, got into talking and saying that you know, two years later would be 2017 and it would be the 500th anniversary of uh, Martin Luther's Reformation. So then the idea of this concert came about. And I think um, this is very exciting because um, I think around the world now, all Lutheran churches um, they are celebrating and commemorating uh, Martin Luther's Reformation and part of the commemor commemoration is the reconciliation um, with the Catholic Church. So, and I think um, this piece is very fitting because um, it is a Catholic Mass but composed by a Lutheran composer, which is Johann Sebastian Bach. I think this is an ambitious project, um, but I do think and am confident that we have some of the best musicians in the countries, but not only the country, but really some of the best musicians in the world that is from Malaysia. And I'm really, really privileged to have this opportunity to be working with um, so many wonderful musicians. And I think that this is going to be a wonderful concert. B minor is actually a work, it's accumulation of all of Bach styles throughout his life. So you get um, a little bit of everything um, of Bach styles and in order to put all this together, you know, you have one movement with just horn and then you have one movement with just the violins and then you have a movement with two oboes. So to get people together in a rehearsal to really um, plan the, the rehearsal and, and all these things is quite challenging but it's also very rewarding. In 2017, the fact that in Malaysia that we are able to put together such a big scale concert um, uh, is a very, very wonderful thing. And I do have high hope um, for the arts and culture in Malaysia. I think right now we are at a very good time, and I think there are more and more people um, starting to learn how to appreciate classical music and we also have more and more um, quality musicians um, that is native. So I'm very hopeful and I think our classical music culture is going to places. So I'm looking forward to um, more wonderful things that's going on in Kuala Lumpur and in the entire Malaysia.